How long does it take to learn to code? All right, guys, let's get into it. So what is your end goal? That's the number one question that you should be really asking. Because a lot of times people search for this word, how long does it take to learn how to code? But in reality, what is it that you want to do with code? That's the real question, right? Do you want to get a job? Do you want to build a business? Do you want to do this for a hobby? And that's going to be the way how you're going to find out the real answer to that question of how long does this take? A content editor, which means managing a website, let's say you wanna find a job as quickly as possible, you can actually learn this in one month. Now, if you wanna go and become a front-end developer, you're gonna to have to learn a lot of things from HTML, CSS, JavaScript, uh, from there learning some frameworks and whatever new packages it's out there, pretty much the best practices and, and whatever the industry is using to find a job, guess what? That's going to take you six to nine months. And again, these are real numbers. Sometimes people sell you in the dream that you can do this in one month, two months. It's capped to actually be a good front end developer is going to take you six to nine months for a content editor. All you're doing is managing a website that's already done. And then from there, you're using CMS tools. So the basics that you need for this is just HTML, CSS. But for this, you're going to need a lot of skills. So it's going to take you time. Now, to become a full stack developer, which means that you are a front end developer, you can work in the back end, you can work with databases, right? Basically, you could build a application from start to finish all by yourself. Guess what? That's going to take you 12 to 18 months. That's basically a year to a year and a half. And that's to actually be good. Someone can tell you, you could do this in a month, you could do this in three months. It's cap. They're lying, right? They're going to show you the basics, the fundamentals of it, but you're not actually a really good full stack developer until you build multiple applications. And each application can take you anywhere from a month to three months, even six months, depending on what you're building. So again, that's just the learning process. So yeah, full stack development does take time because you have to learn everything from the front end and then from there, everything from the back end. And not everyone learns the same way. A lot of people take them a lot of time to actually go and learn their skills. You got to ask yourself, what is the goal that you have? You want to get a job quickly? Guess what? I will say go for this content editor, email developer. Those are things that you can basically learn in about a month to a month and a half. And that's not to say that front end development and full stack development, it's not a good option, but it makes more sense to actually get your first job. And then as you are getting paid, go in and continue learning those other skills. Cause guess what? Maybe you need a job now. Maybe you want to leave that job that you're working at, or maybe you're about to graduate from college and you're like, man, I don't want to wait six months or nine months out here trying to find a job opportunity. I might as well get a job first and then continue learning the more complex things while I'm getting paid within this job. So when I show up there and say, I want to apply as a front end developer, as a full stack developer, I have six months to a year of experience while I'm learning the more complex things. So let's continue. Um, everything else that you might see out here, it all depends on how far you want to take it, right? You want to get a job, guess what? It's going to take you not only six to nine months to learn the skill, but it could take you another three to six months to even find a job opportunity. Same thing for full stack development. Once you actually are good, it might take you another three to six months just to even find a job. So that's something that you want to think about. And if it comes to creating a business, how are you going to create a business if you don't actually know how to do this skills properly? The best way for you to do it is to actually go and get a job. So remember, for you to build a business, you should be able to do this for businesses already. And then from there, you could come up with your own ideas. Now, if you're a hobbyist, guess what? You could go in and do a YouTube tutorial. And guess what? You're not looking for any end goal. You're not looking for a job. You're not looking to build a business. So again, you could watch a tutorial and make you feel like you know how to code. You could do that in one video. But the truth is, if you want to do this professionally, this is the time that it takes, you know, one month for content editing, email development, uh, six to nine months for front end and 12 to 18 months for full stack development. Now, again, guys, 
if you want to go in and you want to learn the skills, especially content editing, uh, content management, email development, guess what? That's what we focus on, codingphase.com. So if you want to go check it out, go check out my website. We've been doing this for over seven years, helping people get into the game. We've got people hired in a lot of good companies. And again, you can see the real results from the Hall of Fame. These are real students that have gotten hired at codingphase.com. So Go take advantage, uh, check out the platform, and yeah, I'll see you guys later.